when you think about all of the great mathematicians who have done incredible things for the field of mathematics, people like Euclid, Galois, Euler, Ramanujan, and you ask yourself, what, what do they all have in common? Well, the obvious answer is that we look at them and we say, these people were mathematical geniuses. They were brilliant. But there's something else. There's something else that they had that we don't have that we can try to reclaim a piece of. And we can't get it back completely, but we can try to get some of it. You see, all of these great mathematicians of the past, besides the fact that we look at them and we know that they were mathematical geniuses, they had something else in common. These people, these mathematicians, they were from the past. They lived in another era. They lived in an era where, I mean, I was gonna say they didn't have internet, but they didn't even have electricity. But let's go back to the internet. No internet, no distractions. No social media, no news articles. I mean, if you open any news article on the internet, it's, it's always something dramatic or negative because that's how they get your attention. And so these people, these mathematicians who did great things, they didn't have these distractions. They had other problems in their life. I don't want to glorify their life. We live, I think now, perhaps in the best of times. We have amazing things and we should be thankful for them. But those things bring negative consequences to our life too. And so how can you recapture what they had while maintaining the positive things that we have today so that you can improve your mathematics, you can improve your focus? Well, it's really simple. Return to the world. This is it. This is the world. We live in front of our screens and that's a reality. You know, people ask me on the street when I meet them all the time, they say, hey, where are you from? And I always want to say, I'm from the internet because I've been on the internet so long. But I don't say that because people will think I'm crazy. Return to the world. And how can you do that? Well, it's pretty simple. You know, the next time you're stuck working on mathematics, the next time you're feeling stressed out about something, go for a walk, go outside. Science, science says that when you go outside and you go for a walk and you get fresh air, it lowers cortisol. I mean, that's a scientific fact. Return to the world, return to nature, return to true mathematics. It can make a huge difference in your performance. Anyways, that's all I wanted to say in this video. Stay strong, my friends.